Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do a reading for Virgo. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, and this is for August, okay? This is for August, so we're just going to see what comes up. Keep in mind that not every reading is for you, and uh, the timing is fluid. This could happen at any time in August, okay? What do we have for Virgo? What do we have for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? We got two of them. We need to get one more. Well, maybe two more. Yeah, we just got two more. So... Ooh. Rose. Romance is in the air. <laughs> Bo, you are highly thought of. Quill, get back to the basics. Four leaf clover. Great, great, good fortune, good luck. So August looks really good, huh? It does. <laughs> Romance is in the air. You are highly thought of. This is good luck. Luck is on your side. It's time to get back to the basics. <clears throat> Somebody is thinking really highly of you. Romantically. There's a romantic you know, sense about this. Uh, this is your lucky break, perhaps. This may be a lucky break for you. Oh my goodness gracious. New love, new love entering your life. So for some of you, this is brand new love, okay? Uh, uh, I just got it may not be it may not be there could be there could be a renewal in love as well deep spiritual connection so this is definitely about love okay you have a deep spiritual connection with somebody there's no doubt about it interesting you take a look at these two little hearts down at the bottom this is two hearts that are touching each other heart to heart You may be having some heart-to-heart -heart conversations with somebody, deepening the bond. There's love in the air, put it that way. Eight, 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 the time is now. Abundance, okay, this is abundance. This is also everlasting love with the infinity sign, okay? Um, you're going to be seeing an abundance, I feel, of love, okay, whether it's support from friends, family, a new love, whatever it is. There's love here. There's things. There's reciprocation. There's something. Uh, I feel like it's meant to be. We just had three cards fall out. Virgo, older man, and 911. So I don't know how that resonates with you, but you could be dealing with an older man uh, that, I don't know, this is Virgo. I think, I think that you're probably the Virgo. This is, uh, it's just like new. It's just like new. Something is happening. It's almost like it's a rebirth of some sort. 911 to me is an emergency. You could, for me, you know, you could be dealing with another Virgo, Virgo, Sun, Moon, or Rising. You uh, could also be dealing with somebody that is born in September, you know, or you're born in September. Um, Something could happen around September 11th. I don't know why. I want to say that. Uh, you could. I also feel like you could be dealing with somebody that's born in the month of August um, with these eights. Um, 
This is like an everlasting love of some sort. And the time is now. Eights are about change and flow and timing. The time is now. So something is happening right now. Let's get one of these. There it is. Hello from heaven. Your loved ones in the spirit world want to connect with you as much as you want to connect with them. They know you've been thinking of them and they're sending you signs and symbols to show you how much they love you, to prove they're with you at this time. So there's somebody that has passed away that is with you at this time. <clears throat> A father's love. So I don't know if it's a father or a father figure. Doesn't have to be, but this is somehow prominent for your reading. A father's love for his son or daughter never dies. The strength gained from such love is often unquantifiable and that it can be tapped into at any time for whatever reason. Whether your father is still here or has passed, a father's love is one of the strongest bonds any of us will ever experience. All right, let's keep going. We're gonna get one of these. Something to do with the father. There is some sort of emergency here with that 911. Whenever I see it, I think of emergency. I don't know what that is. I feel like something is going to happen in August. It is safe for you to love, open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. Some of you may have had an absent father you know, the father may have been there, but he didn't express his love or he was cold or something like that. That may have affected your ability to open your heart. It is safe for your love. So open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. New love. New love. There is definitely new love here for some of you. Absolutely 100%. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. I think I just cut the deck. I don't know why. Getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. And I did the spiritual connection. You're going to be deepening a bond with somebody this month. Intimacy. You know? And that's not just, intimacy is not just sexual, okay? When you're deepening a bond with somebody, into me see, right? Into me see. This is, that's more than just a sexual bond. So anyway, I do believe you're deepening a bond with somebody. You are highly thought of by this person. Six of Pentacles reversed just fell out. This is in the past, not getting what you deserve. You, you didn't get what you deserve in the past. You may have done, been, been conned, right? You may have been conned, you may have been stolen from, or you, you know, didn't get reciprocation. You were rejected, um, one-sided. You may have been in a one-sided situation, You've been treated unfairly. Um, you've been, you've been, uh, oh, now we have the Five of Cups. Five of Cups is grieving grieving over what you didn't deserve some of you may be grieving over or you have been in the past for quite some time over what you didn't deserve i didn't deserve that or not getting any reciprocation being being neglected being rejected i'm not sure if you were rejected there's some sort of rejection here not not getting what you deserve which caused a lot of grief for you Nine of Swords reversed. Nine of Swords reversed is giving deep thought to a relationship, extremely stressed out, uh, in a state of despair. Oh my God, why is this happening? 
there could be a loss here. There could be an emotional loss here. This isn't fair. So maybe, I don't know if you're dealing with that or, or something, there, there could be. Okay, with the Five of Cups, the Nine of Swords, and the Six of Pentacles reversed. Okay, this is like, oh my God, I can't believe this is happening. And in reverse, to me, it's extremes. So I feel like we have somebody here. This is, there's some sort of grieving. You may be grieving over an unplanned Six of Pentacles reversed. Take away. Something is being taken away. Not exactly sure what it is, but I feel like you're going to be in a state of despair of, of some sort, you know. But I feel like there's somebody around you that loves you, obviously. Page of Pentacles reversed. That is a dead end not interested rejection i i do feel like some of you have experienced a rejection or you may be rejecting somebody i'm not sure if somebody rejected you this could be a fraud you know somebody that is a con man that has caused you some sort of grief nine of swords reverse extremely worried about something or extremely distraught there's some sort of distraught here not interested not you may not be interested in something maybe you're not interested in giving to somebody maybe you got somebody else somebody's not interested in giving page of pentacles reverse mirroring the six of pentacles reverse it's not interested not really interested in commitment not really interested in maybe that's where you know there's been this grieving maybe you got you got yourself uh, in a situation where there was a breakup, you know, you broke up with somebody and you didn't deserve it. You have a new love entering your life. You know, maybe you're not, you weren't looking for it. Um, I do feel like you're giving deep thought to at least one of your relationships right now. I feel like your gut is, is telling you that this is not the right path. Um, with that, because the Nine of Swords reverse is listening, is, is extremely haunted, perhaps can't sleep, thinking a lot about something that may not be practical. I think that you're really, really definitely thinking a lot about what who you want to give to, you know, what you want for your life. Four of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles is stability, it's holding on, holding on to stability. Um, perseverance, focusing on your money, focusing on your job, focusing on uh, your stability. I think for some of you, you're really focusing on your stability right now. Two of Wands reversed. There could be a sudden departure or a sudden arrival. This is making a decision. I feel like you've been at some sort of crossroads with a choice that you have to make, but the decision is about to be made. It could be spur of the moment. You could be making a spur of the moment decision um, very, very soon about which, which way that you want to go. I think that you've been thinking about it a lot, which is the best option, you know, which is the most stable option. I think that you've obviously been... It feels like rejected, rejected, maybe you've been rejected a few times. I don't know if this is for something that you've been waiting for, you've been saving up for. Some of you, it could be housing. It doesn't have to be. It could be a home. It's something that will bring you stability. It feels like you've been rejected, whether it's a person or it's it's a, something you can touch. I think that you've been rejected a couple times or a few times or something like that. And you've been waiting for this opportunity that is going to lead you to stability, that is going to be stable, that is going to be solid and secure. I think that you've been treated unfairly, you know, or unfairly judged even. Anyhow, I do believe that a decision is about to be made. It feels like it's going to be made in your favor. There could definitely be a relocation on the table here. Somebody may be relocating. I feel like your hard work is going to pay off whatever it is that you've been working on. I feel like there is one one chapter of your life and I could say season, but I want to say chapter of your life that is over where you've you've been uh waiting to see the benefits, the fruits of your labor and it just it feels like nothing has been paying off, but you're I feel like you're about to receive I do. I feel like you're about to receive something that is going to make you really happy. Um, but you do need to get back to the basics in some way. There is good fortune coming your way. Good luck. We have somebody here that may not have been interested. 
they were focusing on their money now i'm changing the story a little bit maybe your person that you're asking about may not have taken steps the steps that they needed or that you wanted them to which has been causing you so much grief they weren't taking those steps because they were they had to make some sort of choice maybe they had to break up i don't know if they had to break up with somebody or what if this is a third party situation i feel like you haven't been getting the attention that you deserve okay but i feel like things are about to change especially with that two of wands a decision is about to be made i feel like it's going to be made in your favor the two of wands reversed um page of pentacles reversed that is not interested in putting in effort Oh my God, why now? Why is this happening? I'm not sure if somebody is coming back around. You know, when you have 888, you think about the infinity. That's what goes around, comes around. Something coming back around. Something may be coming back around. Okay, something maybe It may have something to do with an older man. I'm not sure. Um, but there is something that is coming back around. I feel like this person was not interested. But it feels like they've been thinking a lot, thinking about their choices, thinking about their stability. Um, temperance reverse. That's unable to refrain. Upset, frustrated. Somebody is here is very, very frustrated. They, they may have gone overboard in some way. They're having a hard time controlling themselves. Re repeating negative patterns. So you... I don't know if it's you or somebody that you're dealing with. You could be dealing with um, anybody really. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sagittarius, Virgo, um, Leo. I feel like we have somebody here that is, it's like they're being haunted. It feels like they're being, and I mean haunted by the messages and they're ignoring the messages it's like they're being they're hearing so much it's like you got to do this you got to do this you got to do this and they're just ignoring it you know you know you know you know you know temperance reversed is unbalanced repeating negative patterns going overboard self-healing is needed you know we may have somebody here that has rushed into something and they need to heal. There's a healing period that is needed. Self-healing is needed with temperance reverse. Now, temperance comes after deaths. And I can see that something has already ended. Something has already ended. And there's a need, need for healing. There's a need to accept and allow. And it feels like there's, there's some sort of resistance. There's resistance to change. There's resistance to open up. There's protection, protecting myself. So some of you are protecting yourself. There's a need to, do, to trust. I feel like your gut. For some of you, you 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 you're distrustful. It feels it feels like your gut is talking to you as well. And I feel like if for some of you you haven't been listening, you're hearing it, you're hearing it, but you're not listening. It's like you're hearing. No, you gotta you gotta walk away from this. You know that's eight eight of cups. That's walk away. You gotta walk away from this. You gotta turn your back on this. You gotta leave the emotional disappointment behind. And I do see emotional disappointment here, not getting what you deserve. This isn't fair. Uh, you could be dealing with somebody that. Um, is very unbalanced this person frustrates you in some way um, they're not giving you they're not giving you what you need you know um, but you're it may be, I don't know if you're holding on to them for stability reasons but not really interested there is new love here though making a choice a spur of the moment decision there's so much indecision here. I think that you're in a very, and I don't need the seven of wands. I think you're in a tough position. I feel like you're, you're dealing with somebody that frustrates you with the temperance reversed. It's frustrating. It feels like you're, you're dealing with somebody who doesn't really put in much effort. You know, they don't really put in much effort, you know. They may cause you stress. They may cause you a lot of stress with that nine of swords reverse. This is very stressful, worried. You know, I think that you're very worried, worried, worried. You know, maybe you don't, maybe you, you're worried about them not choosing you or something like that. 
temperance reversed. That's that's uneasy. This is not easy, but unwilling to accept change, unwilling to change. Tower. Major disruption. So we have a major disruption that is coming. This is it's starting over from scratch. A, a major disturbance, a dismantling. This could be a fight. This could be moving. You never saw it coming. This is something happening that is forced. This is the universe forcing change. So there is going to be a forced change. It could be a change in residence, like I said. Um, a major, a major disruption. So there is going to be a disruption, and you're going to be shocked. You're going to. And here's the seven of wands that I talked about. So this is a tough position. I feel like you, you, this is admitting defeat, it's stepping down. I feel like you're gonna be stepping down from a position that you have been trying to uh, work through. It's like you've been persevering, right? You've been trying to make it work. You've been trying to prove yourself. But I feel like you're, you're dealing with somebody that is, is frustrating you for some reason. This person is frustrating you. Um, I also feel like there's some sort of inappropriate behavior here with the temperance reverse. Somebody is going overboard. I'm not sure if there's even some addictions here. We may have some addictions here where, you know, things things happen. It is, it's very sudden. Now we have the two of wands reverse next to the tower. And the temperance card, sudden change. Something is going to happen and it is sudden change. We have also have a person here that is admitting their defeat. Okay, they they don't they don't want to fight it anymore. They're they're done fighting. They don't want to fight anymore. They're going to be stepping down from their mountain or whatever. They're going to be stepping down from their position, and they're ready to just uh, give in. They're giving in. Somebody's going to be admitting their defeat, and they're going to be um, coming. I feel like they're coming in your direction. I do. I feel like it's like this person. Maybe they've been fighting their feelings or fighting their emotions. You know, they're, you're you're about to get some sort of surprise. I feel like there's some stiff competition here as well. I feel like you've been involved in some sort of stiff competition with another person, you know, and maybe or or maybe maybe there's two people that are vying for you or whatever and you have to make a choice. There's definitely a choice here. There's going to be a sudden change. The universe is involved. Somebody has been going overboard. They have been repeating negative patterns. They have been stuck, okay? They've been stuck, they've been grieving, they've been uh, stalling, procrastinating. Holding on to something for financial reasons or something like that. There's about to be a massive change, okay? Things are going to change really, 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 really fast. I really feel like you've been grieving. You've been grieving over somebody that's not really trying. You know, they're not really putting in much effort. This person has been, maybe somebody's been self-medicating with drugs or alcohol or whatever. There's about to be a major disruption, a major change. A fall from power or a fall from grace or giving up. Somebody is giving up. But they are with the Seven of Pentacles reversed. They're giving up. They're, they're giving up the fight. You know, they were they were trying to maintain their position. This is giving up the position. So somebody is giving up a position. I also feel like you are going to be receiving a stable offer with this Four of Pentacles. This is something that you can hold on to. It's going to make you happy. You're going to be receiving an offer from somebody that's going to make you happy. And that may be one of your shocks. This is all of a sudden spur of the moment. So this is sudden change. Some, and 911 is sudden change as well. You're going to be shocked with whatever is happening. You are. It comes out of nowhere. 
this is this is a false sense of security that is crumbling and you're and it has crumbled for a reason or it is crumbling for a reason there's going to be a change i feel it for some of you somebody's moving it could be a change in your home you know and change on your home front something like that light is going to be shed on a situation this is massive massive change you're going to be building a foundation with somebody that is stable that is solid that is secure but it's very sudden oh my god why is this happening because there's it's happening because there's a lack of togetherness right there's a lack of interest there's there's a lack of integrity you could be dealing with somebody that has a wandering eye you know they need attention there's there's definitely uh unfortunately there's loss here it could be i don't know if it's a loss of a job or it's a loss of a love you know the six of pentacles reverse the five of cups right next to it this is this is a, this is like a, a painful separation of some sort it hurts it's it's grieving it's mourning it's crying over the loss not getting what you deserve oh my god why is this happening why don't why aren't they putting in any effort they're not interested you know they're not interested they're not doing anything uh this person is engaging in negative patterns they're all over the place they're frustrating you there's going to be a moment of of, of tension okay there could be a fight there could be an argument there's something that is happening that forces uh change okay there's going to be a force change you don't see it coming there's going to be an event you know we have somebody here that is socially driven okay they're driven by society they're not interested in a relationship <clears throat> or a commitment or something like that this is almost feels like it's a disgrace as well. Sudden change. Emperor. Could be dealing with an Aries. Doesn't have to be. We also have Scorpio down here with Tower. We have Sagittarius. But this is making a decision. Somebody is making a decision. They are making a wise decision this is somebody that is um has a lot of life experience that does tries to make the best decision for everybody involved does not typically make spur of the moment decisions this is a thinker this is somebody that is very wise uh, very decisive making a judgment call taking a position of authority taking control somebody is about to take control they are about to uh make a decision that obviously forces change there is a decision that is could have something to do with a father with that emperor you're going to be shocked this is a father figure or a person that is in a position of authority that is making the best decision for everybody involved somehow it's going to shock you it is going to surprise you you're going to be surprised This is a decision about stability and security. This person, uh, you're going to be surprised. You're about to be surprised. This person may have been confused or, you know, they were doing some sort of investigation. This is, this is somebody that is, I feel like this person is going to be giving you an opportunity for stability. I do feel like you're going to have to, you may be dealing with some, some pain, there's some grieving this month. So I don't know what this loss is, but the five of cups next to the six of pentacles is, this isn't fair. This isn't fair. This is grieving over some sort of loss. Somebody could be losing a job or I don't know what it is. They're losing something. Somebody is, it's being, it's almost like it's being taken away. There, there's a rejection, grieving over a rejection. 
but things are gonna change. That cut out on me. So what I was saying, I don't know where it ended because I don't have time to, to go back and look, but there's gonna be a sudden change. It's probably a sudden ending that gives you an opportunity for stability, however that resonates with you. You are going to be receiving a stable offer. You probably don't see it coming. You don't see it coming at all. I feel like it's going to happen very suddenly, extremely suddenly. You could be dealing with somebody that, uh, you know, there could be a sudden departure that leads to a sudden arrival. You know what I'm saying? So there's going to be a change that you do not expect. We also have somebody here that whose health is declining. Okay, there's some ill health here, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. There could be an explosion, okay? There could be some sort of explosion with this health problem. Um, I don't know if you heard me say it could be dealing with a father figure. It doesn't have to be a father, a husband, a masculine. Somebody is taking control. This is somebody that is interested in stability, interested in security, that is organized and structured and going is making a decision that you know, is going to bring stability to whatever this is going on. You are going to be receiving something that I feel like you don't expect, you totally don't expect it from somebody that you've probably been grieving over. And, and if you're single, say if you're single and you're, and you're completely single, there is somebody here, this, this new love that is entering your life that is solid. This person is solid. This person is stable. This person is secure. This person has a lot of life experience. They're ready to settle down. Um, they've, they, they're uh, wise very very wise this person may be a business owner or a position or in a position of authority has earned their title okay this person is uh extremely stable um anyway you're it feels like you're gonna be given an opportunity that really surprises you after you've been rejected You know, it's almost like, it's almost like they, they, whoever is giving you this offer, you were, you were being rejected, being rejected, being rejected, you know, and now, now you're going to receive it. Whatever this offer is, whether it's a job or it's a home or it's a partner, receiving this offer, that is going to be a complete shock. This person was indecisive. They may have even chosen somebody else, you know, over you. But it's now maybe they've had some sort of tower moment. You know, maybe it didn't work out with that other option. That's what it looks like to me. They're coming back around for you. That's exactly what it looks like for me. Good luck.